Every year I make videos about smart business cards, but one thing always gets called out. They're expensive. Either the card is super expensive or they're so limited that you need to pay for a premium plan and that plan ends up being extremely expensive. But we silently just got a massive update from Wave that gives most of their features for free, making it the best choice if you don't wanna pay for a subscription. So what is a smart business card? It's simply a business card with an NFC card inside that lets you tap with your phone and then you're taken to a web page with all of your info on it. It's sort of like a traditional business card, but then elevated. And here's where things get interesting. I review all business cards on the market once every year, and you can imagine there's a bunch of companies all with their own take on what the page should look like, all with a varying amount of features, some of which are hidden behind a paywall. So then I asked myself, which one is the best card for free? And that's where I landed on the Wave card. So Wave has these really cool metal cards that come in a variety of different options, including a simple black custom card, a stainless steel option that looks incredible, and a 24 karat gold option if you really want to impress. But no matter which option you choose, if at all, they're all really premium to the touch. But then if you turn it around, you see either a QR code, which you can scan with your phone, or an NFC card inside that you can tap. Now obviously these aren't free if you want a card, but you can actually get one of these pages for free just by signing up on their site. No catch. And then instead of using a digital business card, you can share your profile with a link, or you can use a digital QR code that you can download, or you can add to Google or Apple Wallet to access it really easily from your phone. You can also add a widget on your home screen, which looks awesome, or you can even have a live widget on your lock screen. It's kind of amazing. It makes you question if you ever even really needed a physical card to begin with, right? If you have all these other options, then why use the card? But back to the main point, which is what can you do for free? Well, setting up my profile, I just sign up on Wave's site and I can immediately create a profile without even needing a password. Upon sign up, I can immediately start creating my profile with social links, bios, websites, images, and contact info. When adding to your page, you can quickly set up custom links for free and you can reorder content on your page. You can also add a profile photo and a cover photo for free for a more complete look. The finished product of my free page is here with a lead form pop-up which can be enabled or disabled, then my details, exchange button, bio, social links, all of my additional profiles which pull in the photos on the side from my sites, then my contact info, Overall, it's a great start, again, for a page for free. When a lead reaches my page, they get a lead capture form that helps to save your information or exchange info to connect both of you. And there's no limit to how many times your profile can be shared, tapped, or scanned. Again, it's all free. So now that you have the basics of what this card can do for free to create a nice looking page, when does it make sense to upgrade to pro features? Well, for that, I have another account on a pro plan. Immediately, you notice that the page looks completely different than the free one. That's thanks to the custom appearance you get with pro, which lets you change from the default to a full photo layout or a full background layout. You can change the font, you can change the color, the background color, even the look and feel of the buttons. You can also add your own custom logos and remove the wave branding on the footer of the page and the QR code when sharing. You also get the ability to change the look of your Apple or Google Wallet Pass to something that fits your brand better, which I thought was a really unique touch. So it seems like the paid version of Wave is all about refining the page and then making it look a lot more like your brand. But there's also a few other areas that Pro has, like the ability to customize your lead form to gather exactly what information you need and remove what you don't. You also get a business card scanner that instantly converts business cards to digital leads in your Wave platform. And then they can also let you connect directly to a CRM so your leads can immediately be passed to the database of your choice for even more flexibility. So that pretty much covers individuals, but what about Teams or enterprise users? So on the Teams platform, you get all those same things that we just talked about with the addition of sort of managing all of your users in bulk. In your admin dashboard, you can create users individually or in bulk with an import. You can manage and distribute cards amongst your team. And then it's really simple. Assign your users to Teams and then create templates for that theme so that everyone's profiles follow a similar pattern. You can have unlimited templates for consistent branding. You can have unlimited sub teams to organize your company in whatever way works best for you. It all just really works easily. When editing a template, you get a lot of really great tools like the ability to make links unique to the individual or uniform for the whole team. You get advanced analytics on individuals, entire teams, or the entire organization to see what's working best. You also get centralized lead storage where all contacts can be viewed. You can leave notes, 
or you can export to a CRM. And with this package, you also get multiple layers of permissions from managing the whole organization, access to all teams, access to select teams, or view-only access. Teams users get access to discounted rates as they scale to larger organizations. They also get single sign-on for the entire organization, seat management with SCIM, the ability to add a custom domain to maintain their brand, and integrations for automatic provisioning. Teams users also get assisted onboarding and priority support from Wave. So in a world where everything seems to be locked behind a paywall, it's refreshing to see a company uncover so many features for free and give you the opportunity to pay for it, but where it actually makes sense. Like as an individual user, I would say that most of you only need the free version with the option to pay for a physical card maybe if you want it, but then for those who want better flexibility of branding, you jump up to the pro level. And then if you're managing multiple team members, that's where the Teams platform makes a lot more sense. If you wanna pick up a Wave card or get started, I'll leave a link in the description for their platform. A huge thank you to Wave for sponsoring this video and to you for watching. I've been using Wave for the past few years, so if you do have any questions about Wave or really any other smart business card on the market, let me know that in the comments down below. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.